to see if my wife had pulled the coil wire out since we parked the car under a cover and we don't drive it. This way someone can't steal it because, you know, we keep the coal wire in the house. Well, she left it on, so when I went to go pull the coil wire, what I ran into was I bumped this with my finger right there, and I heard this and I noticed this popped out of the carburetor. Look at that right there. What a fire hazard. Now, what happened was that when we bought the car, I told her the first thing we replace is this. We need a Brady Steel hose up there and some wire to maintain these clamps on and the Brady Steel hose so the clamp doesn't cut through. And this filter goes under the front gas tank. Well, less than a tank of gas, this popped out. We bought a brand new Impy carburetor. Yes, it's a Chinese carburetor, but with at least some Impy quality control over the cheaper Chinese carburetors, which are like $40 cheaper on Amazon and eBay. What you notice, this is a barb fitting that screws in, not a pressed in fitting. We figured, uh, let the gas tank run out, and when the gas tank's empty, empty not empty, we would then therefore do a filter change. That didn't happen. Before the gas tank got to the reserve line, that non-barb fitting popped out. Luckily the car had been parked and I had just bumped it with my finger and checked it. We could have been driving and that could have popped out pumping fuel at three pounds of pressure and catching the car on fire. So don't wait to remove your filter.